Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It is me, Lasty, here. Welcome today to a brand new episode of the FC24 Ultimate Team Road to Glory. Episode number 216 today. Hope you're all doing well. Let's just get straight into it. I'll show you the squad and uh, we'll figure out a plan for what to do today. If you do enjoy, do me a small favor, hit that thumbs up button. That'd be fantastic. And of course, don't forget to subscribe as well to my channel if you are new. So this is where we're at with the team. Uh, yes, I sold Drogba, but I tell you what, these two have been firing up front. I've been really enjoying them. Um, obviously, Timo Werner, we know, is fantastic. But yeah, I've actually been enjoying Robbie Keane as well. And Garincha and Kaka. We've just been enjoying our games, which you have some weeks where you absolutely love the game. Some weeks where you absolutely hate the game. So far this week, it's been one of the uh, the former. So uh, yeah, we're we're chilling with this squad right here. Big shout outs to Vidic. He's a man mountain. We really like him. Um, but yeah, I'll uh, I'll move on to either my daily SBCs or a game of whatever we're going to play. Let's move on. Ew, it's a nice, nice squad. A couple of decent reds in there. I kind of went off it a little bit more. So I'm like medium. It's just safer for me. Oh dear. Go on, Turbo. Turbo Timo. There we go. One all. I tend to go out for a walk every night, just a little walk, get my steps in. And then uh, if it's more of like a tempo walk where I'm adding a bit of jogging in, I'll do that at night time as well, really. I should have timed the, the shot, the first shot originally, it should have gone in, but we'll take the goal. This guy seems pretty competent, though. Really a pen, is it? Is it? Vidich! Right, he is a menace from corners, isn't he? Okay, who's the next opponent got, then? Oh, man, that's a squad. Oh, that Raul. I've never played against him. But he's 5-5 five -five with technical and finesse. And we're 1-0 up in two minutes, and I didn't even have kickoff. Blue nil. Oh, mate, Robbie Keane is flying. A little rage quit there. Was that a hat-trick? Crazy. The Enzo way. Leicester versus Ipswich here. 87 Vestergaard, 89 Jewsbury Hall. I rate it. It's got an all bright. It's got lots of good Leicester players in there. You always wait for the goalkeeper movement if you've got loads of space like that. 2 0. Great dribbling by Garincha. I am team PSG. Well, I'm team, I'm team turnaround, basically. Very now. PSG to win. Dortmund to win. Basically, one, because I've done Mookie LA. So uh, I'm hoping that PSG turn it around for my SBC card. Uh, and then I just prefer Dortmund to Atletico. So. Oh, oh that is just phenomenal from Gary Rincher. Made that 5 0. All right, we get a nice 10-5 victory in that one. What a game that was. Anyway. Oof. Now that's a team. Oh, wow. He's purchased me a ham. But we're through. Oh, dear. Hey, that's what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. Oh, lovely goal. Like that from you, Timo. Come on, you got to quit after that one. There we go. One more win to go for rivals this week. Yes, yes, yes. Not the greatest team. Watch this person be an absolute demon. Rolfo. Let's get the ball back out wide. Love that. Werner's in there. Bicey. 
Oh, what a goal that is from Timo Werner. Love it. What a goal, man. I mean, that's so lucky. That is so lucky. How did that fall back to me there? <laughs> I moved the goalie so much. What an idiot. Hey, Rolfo gets the goal back. Moved my goalie the wrong way. All right, seven out of seven wins for the week, and we're on a proper hot streak headed towards Division 3. Damn. Got an objective completed. We've completed the season already, though. Uh, warm up and win. We've unlocked ourselves Tevez, and we are close to unlocking Abedi Pele. And not too far off of unlocking Di Natale. And then we've got to play three games with all of them. So not bad. I, of course, have a better version of this card in my club already. The UCL one, but I don't have the fantasy one. All right, mates. So it's me, Green Screen Lasty, here for the rest of the episode. I thought, uh, well, mainly the fact that the servers were down a whole bunch yesterday uh, by the time you're watching this. Uh, that I I couldn't stream, so uh, you haven't got live stream content. You've got you got me, Green Screen Lasty. Uh, so I was sat there trying to get on the servers for a lot of the day and, and that wasn't happening uh, but eventually they came back up so i got back on with my essentially like the daily grind uh, and i've incorporated some player picks into that now so my current team of the season preparation grind is basically what we're doing here for the next few minutes um i am opening up as many player picks as i can get my hands on in little batches of 10 uh, so you'll see two or three batches of those here today. Um, now you might be thinking, well, I've run out of low low end golds. What? How? How do I get my player picks? Well, I am. I'm simply keeping the really really big packs in my store ready for the team of the season pack opening. That will hopefully be like Friday night if whatever we've got coming is good enough. Uh, if not, I'm sure we'll end up having like one more week to wait or something. But hopefully we can open some big old packs at least. Um, but yeah, I'm 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 kind of opening 83 and below packs, but saving the 83 times tens. So uh, any packs that I get from random SBCs here, there, and everywhere, getting them open, getting the rares and non-rares that come out of those, and then doing player picks with them, uh, duplicate stuff. Or I need I know I needed to finish off a team of the week player pick here, so uh, I got that done. Um, and just adding to the club in various ways. You know, those player picks, they'll either give me a nice high-rated walkout like a Joshua Kimmich, which then gets me uh, a good exchange SBC, an 88-rated exchange SBC, and then I get uh, like 27 more players or whatnot. Um, or they get me that mid-tier fodder that can go into an 83 times 10 and I can keep farming three of those every day, add into that pile of packs that we've got ready for team of the season so uh genuinely looking forward to uh to getting stuck into that another batch of uh, daily tots warm-up games played uh got me some more packs that i can open these are just like 80 times twos 80 times fives uh but yeah we're in that sort of like Hopefully, it's the last couple of days of things being really kind of quiet on the game. Um, I've still got a little bit of the TOTS warm-up cup um, to do. I'm about halfway through that, but that doesn't really necessarily give out like the most crazy rewards. It was mainly for the XP that I was playing that, and I've got that now. Completed the season, done the icon picks. They were in yesterday's video, um, if you missed that, of, of course. Uh, but yeah, so essentially that's the plan that's what i'm that's what i'm up to that's what i'm doing uh and i would imagine quite a lot of you are either at a similar point to me where you've got like a decent amount i've got nearly 30 very very good packs um or there'll be some of you that have been saving up for a month or so and you've got way over a hundred crazy packs millions and millions of coins worth uh, and you are just waiting, just patiently waiting. It is that it's the the slowest days ever at the moment as we wait and anticipate for team of the season, which we all know is a uh, a fun one. Typically, the summer content of uh, of Ultimate Team is basically what 
is is determined by when top starts for me um i saw nep saying about it that it was when like ultimate birthday started that's when he knows the weather is getting better and all of that stuff but for me team of the season is really like the, the beginning of the crazy content where everything just goes nutty now we may have been in that crazy content for the last month because a lot of people's teams and players have increased like tenfold over the last few weeks um but yeah we are we are now at that point where i just imagine tots cards are going to be nuts i saw the uh the front page of ultimate team as i was logging in after the servers after the server maintenance was done i noticed uh, a red tots like item so that is, uh, I'm guessing, something we're getting during team of the season, like red player picks almost are back or red player packs, whatever they are, but with a slightly different design. Um, so a nice uh, a nice red version of like a TOTS card. Uh, it was quite understated, but I think it will look cool uh, on console when, when you get it in your squad. So uh, whatever I can do to earn them, I'm going to hopefully be able to muster up. Hopefully they don't set it too high at like 14 wins in, in champs and like division one or something in rivals. Uh, hopefully us more average players can still attain some cool stuff. But I'm sure all of our clubs will be going uh, blue and gold in the next, for the next month or a few weeks before the Euros. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I mean, I've been packing all sorts of stuff here. I am going to put this 89 Drogba. I was trying to think to myself, what players have I got here that aren't live still or that I don't really mind to put into an SBC because I wanted to get more player picks. So that Drogba was one of them. I know if I want to go and get a Drogba again, I'll go out and buy the Galazzo one for sure. Um, and then I put uh, Joshua Kimmich back into... Um, one of these as well so we get the 27 player pack we get the 51 player pack and that will easily get me another batch of player picks done uh where if we can get walkouts again from that then what essentially we've ended up with good mid-tier fodder uh and the ability to rerun some more player picks um which is literally that's the cycle at the moment stick an 88 rated into a into an SBC or an 89 rated if you're lucky enough to have them. Stick them into an SBC, get the 50 players from that, open player picks with that, hopefully get a nice high rated card again. Uh, but you've also got a batch of mid tier cards that you can complete your 83 times 10s with and then do it all again. Put the 89 back into a 51 player pack, do that, get more player picks, open more player picks. That's essentially what I'm doing. Hopefully for only about like 24 more hours. Um, because once I can, once I can get stuck into opening up, uh, my big packs, I'm, I'm thinking we're going to need a big SBC. And if a big SBC doesn't come out straight away, I might start dumping high rated fodder into like Ronaldinho's SBC or something just because we've got so many like high tier number packs to open once Tots is here that, um, yeah, we're going to, I'm going to need something big to put them into. Otherwise we're going to end up. I, like, we're going to have so many dupes, basically, is, is what I'm trying to get at. So, uh, yeah, we're coming towards the end of another slightly shorter episode. But as you can see here, things have been going well. I've got that Kimmich back again from the player picks. I've got an Oblak back again. Um, or oh, I've got an Oblak. So, uh, two 88s in this little batch so far. With the odd 85, a few 83s and 84s. And then we end with the daily Luka Modric. What a perfect way to uh, to end out an episode here on, uh, on last these RTG. So, uh, yeah, my friends, um, I'm imagining that the streaming will recommence now that the servers are better and we will get the cup done. We'll get more packs added in. We'll get the daily SBCs done. Carry that on until things just turn tots colored on this game. And I cannot wait. We're nearly there. Hold on just a little bit longer to those packs and you should be able to open them real soon. My friends, we've come towards the end of the episode. I do hope you've enjoyed. If you have, do me a small favor and hit that thumbs up button. That'd be brilliant. Subscribe as well to my channel if you're new. Cheers and follow me on social media. The links are down below. Have a great day. Take it easy. Stay safe and healthy and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.